all four of you, having just defeated a brood mother and her entire brood, well, more so her brood PM. has cleaned itself up. <clears throat> okay. Um, you have all decided, some more begrudgingly than others, to collect one of to collect one of the remaining eggs from from the brood mother and bring it along with you back home for scientific experiments. Yeah, we gotta give it to the artificers. Um so as as you all start to clear out Taking, taking your spoils with you, and hearing the sounds of of what sounds like thousands of bugs ripping each other apart. Don't worry about it, it's fine. Like ants. You, uh, you make your way out of the mines and <clears throat> and, uh, work your way back out the, uh, the entrance. As, as you come out, come out the mines. You are greeted by, by the scouting force, who ha are all still in their defensive positions, save for a few that are now uh, being tended to by, by the uh, the unit's uh, medic, and are taking a rest. Huh. <sighs> my lords and lady, I. I trust everything went well. Yep. Just fine. I, uh... I suppose be careful if you go back in there. Not that I think... Not that I have... I think you have any intention of doing as such. Uh, the rest of the, um... The rest of the hive is currently, um... Cleaning itself up. For lack of better words. <sighs> Well, then I take it the situation is handled. Yes. Yep. Well, considering what, you, considering how you've made it sound, then I'll we'll probably wait a couple of days and get a few soldiers in here and just do a sweep and clear to make sure everything else is is contained. Don't want the place to become green infested. Of course. Oh, we 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 got rid of all the all the grid that we saw, but you know, there could always be more hiding in the walls. I what think the it... men tell me that's where they came from. Well, with the death of the queen, the uh, the swarm seems to have just descended upon itself. It was almost death. It was quite deafening. To call the buzzing in there after the queen fell. I'm sure. I'm sure that whatever fraction of a swarm remains it will not be a quarter as concerning as what the uh, as what the what was in there to begin with. <sighs> Agreed. It shouldn't be too much difficult to just get it to have a, a, a small group of soldiers clear out the rest of the mines. Well, thank you uh, extensively. Uh, my apologies for having to pull you away from from your other obligations. I'm sure you have many in the city. You, your, uh, your runner caught us just as we were finishing up, uh, beating the shit up, uh, me and Gore beating the shit up out of each other. For sport. <sighs> so, you caught us as about, you, you caught us about as best of a time as you could. I'm glad he was able to make it. He's one of my fastest. 
granted, this wasn't half an hour, this was an hour and a half away by wind walk, which is very fast, and I'm quite sure it was significantly farther by ground. He's going to be okay, right? <sighs> I hope so. Chances are he's he's likely after informing you I wouldn't be surprised if he immediately fell over. Uh, I don't think we I don't think we stuck around. I, I don't think we stuck around chances fast. Are he's, chances are he's likely to be intended to. But yeah, I hopefully. would appreciate you check back once you get back to the city. Can do. <sighs> Well, we'll stay around here for a few more days while we wait for while we wait for the soldiers to uh, some soldiers to arrive as backup. Uh, last note, uh, preferably move in compact groups. They'll have a harder try if they get you off. Uh, if they get you split off. They have a far easier time getting you that way. Numbers and all. Yes. At least from the sounds of it, they're disorganized, meaning that a, a group of them attacking is far less likely. True. Carry on. We shall be off to back off to the city now. And he gives you a, a salute. <sighs> Before he uh, turns around and... Uh, goes to go and tell his men that they can relax a little bit. Nice. Alright. Alright. Try- Return to Cloud, Ru H. We return- We do we returning to Cloud. We return to Cloud. Return to Cloud. Return to Moisture. I knew you were gonna fucking make that joke. What? I said it's Final Fantasy VII in here. Oh. Oh, did you start right. recording, by the way, Alex? Yeah, I started recording. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so. You'll make your way back to the city as as clouds once more. An hour and a half um, later. Hour and a half later, you all arrive back at the city and uh, yeah. What would you like? What would you like to do now that you have finished with the mines? Go check up on the runner. Hmm. Yeah, we should check up on the runner. He did. He did run. A really long time. Like, how many levels of exhaustion is that, does that man have? Well, is he he's, okay? He's probably not dead, but... He's not dead, so... He's fine. Alright, so... You return to the pits where he came into contact with you, and, um... You, all, you ask after him, and you are taken... Uh, you're taken to one of the resting areas in the pits, where uh, he is currently passed the fuck out. Yeah, that yeah, makes that's sense. Okay. Yeah, that. Yeah, that tracks. Uh, with um, with about three three people around him, all just uh. One is is giving him what looks like a basic medical check over. Another is uh, staying there with a water skin uh, to help to help him hydrate. It, it, you're guessing before he passed out and when he wakes up. And a third is is a. Uh, is standing guard at the room, and as you walk up, he greets you. Ah, my lords and lady. The uh, runner who who came in collapsed soon after you left. I 
can't be surprised. He ran a ran probably a three hour a three hour marathon. Three plus hour marathon to get to get here is to get here. Yes, the uh the poor man the poor man was ba was barely standing when you left and once he didn't have to keep up keep up dignity, he very quickly fell down to fell down onto his ass and we got some water into him before he lay down and passed out. Hmm. The uh the doctor says he'll be alright, he just needs a few hours of sleep. And probably several days off of his feet. Mm -hmm. I can't, can't say I'm surprised. Well, he's alive. That's what we were asked to check in on. Well, he's okay, air quotes. Yeah, don't worry about him. We'll look after him. Once he wakes up, we'll give him some more fluids and get some food in him. That'll probably help him out a lot. Did you get his name? Did you get his name before he passed out? Oh, he didn't get his name, but uh, I know him. I know him from the scout groups. His, his name is Frederick. Frederick. I'll have to keep that in mind. I may want to speak with him later. I will send a message one once he wakes up. Then. Excellent. All right then. Now what? I'm assume. I'm assuming everyone bit, bit, went off back to resume their daily daily routines. Hmm. Soon after we left. Indeed. Everyone, there was a small party outside the outside the pits once once the once the uh, the fight had concluded. People. People were quite excited and laughs and drinks with Jack. Can't say I blame them. It seems the new it seems the reception the reception for the new pets has been quite positive amongst the majority of the population. Well, I hope they don't expect every fight to be as grand as ours. <clears throat> All right. I, I think a lot of people are probably simply happy to, to see some steam being blown off. <laughs> and I'm sure I'm sure those who were betting had a fun time too, or not. I'm sure I'm sure a fair amount of money. Pe I'm sure a fair amount of people lost a lot of gold. <laughs>